In this episode of Alzheimer's Caregiving and the Caregivers, I'm sitting down with Tony Veracella. Good to have you back. Hello, nice to see you again. Absolutely. You know, it's great to have you because it's a holiday season and we really want to talk about how we can make this season special for our loved ones, especially if they have um, Alzheimer's. How can we do that? No, absolutely. I think, um, and you know, even though I'm going to be talking a lot about the holiday is Christmas and New Year's, a lot of people will celebrate other types of holidays. So this can hopefully help them regardless of the time of the year and whatever holiday they're celebrating. The first thing is, you know, we really want to get everybody in the holiday spirit and rekindle old memories, especially, of course, for your loved one. So I think the first thing starts with decorations. You know, everybody has their, you know, it's gonna be the tree, the lights, the wreaths, the stockings, uh, pillows, anything and everything. So get them involved and engaged in that. Um, next, you're gonna always make sure we tie in holiday music. And, you know, these days it's really easy and all the cable you know, st uh, channels are out there. Mm -hmm. uh, you can, of course, create your own playlist on your phone, you know, whatever it takes. Uh, so that helps. And then, uh, of course, we always eat a lot and drink a lot during the holidays. <laughs> yes, so we do. <laughs> all the festive, you know, dishes, plates, napkins, you know, serving pieces, you know, whatever. All those things are just there to kind of create that warm background of memories. And you never know what's going to trigger uh, a smile, you know, from your loved one, you know, during any of those times. Wrap these beautiful photo albums of your family, a great way to rekindle memories. Yeah, these are awesome because uh, really you never know what's going to strike a chord, you know, for your loved one. And uh, one of these is Christmas uh, for 30 years. Uh, one is Dana's childhood all the way to uh, current day. One's about our triplets from the time they were born, which was in December. So uh, these are all super positive. And uh, one, last week she flashed on one picture in here, got a big smile on her face. Uh, it was very emotional. She actually bent down to kiss the picture. It was her mom and her dad and one of her nieces. So, you know, that certainly rekindles memories. Christmas clothes, pajamas, you know, all those things. Watching old movies or new ones, whatever traditions your family had, you want to keep those fresh because they're good to have anyway. I mean, you want to do it with, with your kids, you know, as well. Anything you can do. Get them involved in cooking, baking, you know, every aspect. Uh, it really is such a positive thing, but the one thing is try not to focus on the results of their actions. So if they're helping you with cooking and baking and it kind of messes it up, you know, so be it. The key is that they're involved with it. So don't focus on the, uh, the actions. Get them involved in gift exchanges, uh, fill the stockings, you know, all these things uh, are just so positive and rewarding for them. Remember why you're doing it. This is for your loved one and for you and the family. Um, and you have to try to still keep routines for your loved one as normal as possible. Don't, don't change your timing of routines or anything. All right, and one of my favorite things when we do this segment is to yeah. talk about the message of hope. Tell me about the message of hope. Yeah, so this one is from Josephine Billings. She was a longtime volunteer healthcare worker or advocate, and she always said there's, you, know, you may only be one person in the world, but to one person, you may be the world. And, uh, and that's really you know, what we are doing at this point. Thank you so much for finishing up yeah. with that. And um, we're always going to have everything on HeinelDaily.com as well. Tony, thank you so much for joining me today. Thanks, Rachel. All right. Happy holidays. Happy holidays.